Hi guys and welcome to today's Photoshop tutorial and in this episode I'm going to be showing you how to create simple but sleek social network icons. So first off I'm going to open the social network icon and this is going to be DeviantArt. I'm sure most of you know or are familiar with this logo. Then I'm just going to create a new document, I'm going to make it uh, say 1500 by 1000 pixels, that should be okay. Then I'm just going to copy this onto this document. You don't really have to do this, I'm just doing this for the purpose of the tutorial. Uh, there we go. And so you can see the effects of the actual um, sleek look. I'm going to just make the background a dark grey. Now the first thing you want to do is you want to open your blending options on your layer. I'm just going to rename it here to DeviantArt logo. You want to open up your layer styles. And then the first thing you want to do is you want to give it a gradient overlay and then you want to change it to color burn or even dark color it's really up to you but I'll choose color burn and then just take down the opacity now what I like to do is get the gradient and change the darker color to a color of the similar sort of green but darker so say like this so that looks quite nice and then the lighter instead of pure white like another green too. So maybe something like that. I'll make that probably a bit darker actually, just so you can see it better. Okay, and then you want to put the scale to about sort of 56%, but it depends on the size of your uh, logo anyway. That's going to depend on the scale size because um, if your logo is massive, the scale is probably going to have to be larger. So um, anyway, yeah, so just so the gradient looks like that anyway. And the next thing you want to do is add an inner shadow and change the colour to like a light green. Now, um, I would say never ever use white, but obviously you can for certain logos if they're grey or something like that. Change the blend mode to normal and change the size. So you can see it here at the top, but you don't want it to look too kind of, that looks too kind of soft, so maybe make it a bit sharper by reducing the size and adjusting the distance as well also you can change the degree of this kind of shine that looks a lot better in my opinion we can make it more sort of or you very well you can well you can change the angle to however you want it to be I suppose it depends on the light source on your banner or YouTube um, design or thumbnail or whatever you're doing this for uh, that's all dependent on where the light source is coming from so for where you put this uh, light of course but anyway we'll add that nice kind of overlay there may be a drop shadow as well like so and that's basically it actually that's that's it on how to make these sleek social network icons you see that really did not take much time it's basically just utilizing the color and the lighting and just making it look a bit more interesting than just a 2d logo i hope this tutorial has been useful if it has been feel free to subscribe as more photoshop tutorials will be on the way and of course leave a comment or share this video on your social networks i hope this video has been useful and i'll see you guys in another video soon